hello guys welcome back to my channel it's your boy Jim graphics in this video i'll be teaching you guys how to export your design from corel draw to a jpeg format all right um a lot of you might have known this and due to the beginners i have in this channel and those who are watching and trying to know corel draw for the first time um please i i know um, we have gone a long way actually but if you're new to Corel Draw please go and check out this particular video all right um, if you're done watching this video I believe you will know the step-by-step -step process and the tools which we are using to create most of our designs all right so what you're going to do now is just go check out that video and um, watch Alright, so um, now in this video, I just want to teach you guys how to export your design when you're done designing from CorelDRAW to um, JPEG format, alright? So if you're new to this channel, please don't forget to um, subscribe to this channel and um, give this video a thumbs up and also share this video and invite your friends to this channel, alright? So um, this is CorelDRAW guys. So once you're done designing and when you're done designing, um, the next thing is to present your design to your clients, all right, or your customers, okay? So what you're going to do is um, you're going to come over to your um, design um, and select, drag and select this way, all right? This is how to select, or you can use a shortcut, Control A on your keyboard, just right here and it's going to select your design for you and basically all right you can actually come over to file on your menu bar all right you're going to see where it's written export all right the shortcut is control plus e all right so once you click on export a box is going to come up just right here all right we've clicked on export on our file and now i'm going to show you guys the shortcut which is ctrl plus e so once you select like i said ctrl a to select and um, if you use ctrl plus e is the same thing as going to your file and select your export all right so um now what you're going to do is select you're gonna see where um, where you have this organized, all right. So basically, over here is 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 asking you like where do you want to save your design, all right? Where do you want to export the design to, or a folder? If you have a particular folder where you are um, like exporting or where you're saving your designs, you're gonna locate that in this dialog box. All right, it's either the um, the folder or where you want to export is on desktop, download, pictures, document, or a created folders. All right, so um, basically, now you can actually, if you want to um, export to um, your desktop, you're just gonna come over to this place and select desktop. All right, so now you can you will see over here we have. Um, we have um, file name so what you're going to do is you type in the name you want to save the design all right it's either okay we're having a magazine cover so what you're going to do is just type in magazine and leave that to that and you come over to this save as type then just click on this box here and boom guys you're going to see we have lots and lots and lots of options here now what you're going to do is you're going to press like the J on your keyboard and you're going to locate the one that says JPEG, JPG, all right, to JPEG bitmap, all right. This is the one you're going to select, but don't select this JPEG 2000 bitmaps. Just go straight and select JPG, JPEG bitmap, all right. So once you click on this, already you've typed the name then now you might have multiple um designs here because um somebody was telling me his um his design is not actually 
like um, for instance all right let me close this and show you guys for instance all right assuming we have let's assume we have double of this and you want to export just this work all right there are settings you're going to select there are things you, you need to do to make you select and export just this particular um design without bringing in this one all right now what you're going to do is once you select this we are trying to export just one what i'm saying is in case you have multiple designs here or multiple objects here or files or anything that you don't want to export alongside the one you want to export once you click on Control plus e to export or you come over to your file and select export all right now we're having two options here remember we have a selected option which is this one now what you're going to do is once it's, um you give it the name magazine all right magazine all right so we're exporting to desktop now what you're going to do is you come you, you come over to here that says selected only selected only once you check this selected only make sure it's checked all right make sure it's checked now you can see we have the date that is um is being exported we have the time all right so you can add tags if you wish but i don't think i do that actually so just select this selected only after selecting the location where you want your design to be export now click on export and hold on now this box is going to come up all right in this place we're going to do just basic settings nothing much all right so we're going to just wait for our um design to come up here which is it has actually come up so now we are having our color mode on cmyk so you're going to select this and change it to rgb all right so once you do that this is just basically what you're going to have so you can actually um, come to your quality and choose any quality you want high medium low lowest custom how you want it but i go for highest all right because it, ge it gives me the um quality i want all right so once you do that just click on ok all right and um we'll go to our desktop and you can see over here we have magazine exported all right so basically guys this is how to export your design from Corel Raw to a JPEG format. And guys, if you have any question, please don't forget drop me a comment in the comment section below and give this video a thumbs up. All right, and um, see you guys in my next video.